Hi everyone, welcome back. So far many people have cleared their exam watching my videos and they have shared their feedback that these videos were really helpful and they are scoring really good marks. I want to encourage you to please share your feedback about exams, about the type of questions you are getting and do share it with me in comments so that I can create more content around those questions. If you are going to put your experience in comments, it will not just help me to create more content, but it will also help others to see what things are coming into the exam. If you are watching my video for the first time, I suggest you to watch my previous videos and continue with this one. And do practice all these questions before attempting the exam. So let's get started. This is our question number 23 and the weightage of this question is 7%. The question is create an output pod which writes congratulations you have passed CK exam into a file output pod.txt. The pod output pod should be deleted automatically after writing the text to the file. So basically we need to run a pod with the name output pod and this pod should write this text message into a file called output pod.txt and this pod should get deleted automatically as soon as it is done completing this task. So for this we will be using an imperative command so if you don't know what imperative command is, I suggest you to watch my tips video. So to see imperative commands, as I said, you can open Kubernetes documentation. So we will search for cheat sheet. And here is kubectl command cheat sheet. And this is the kubectl cheat sheet. So we will just look for kubectl run command. As you can see, we have this interactive shell and here we can see that we can run a pod as interactive shell and we can just, you know, execute some command. So this is something which we will use. We will not use it as it is. We will obviously modify it as per our need because we want to run a command as well. So let's go to the playground. This is the playground I'm using on killer coda. So we will run kubectl run output pod. And we want to use the image busybox. We will provide the option IT. And there is an option to remove the pod. And then we will pass the option restart. And we will say never because we don't want this pod to restart again. Then we will put double hyphen and we will say to execute shell. And we will pass the command echo. Congratulations. You have passed the CK exam. We can copy paste this message as it is from there. Now we will need to write this into the file output pod.txt. So this is our complete imperative command that we would like to run. So let's run this. Okay, so there is an error. We need to run the command with hyphen hyphen rm instead of hyphen rm. Okay, now it's running. Okay, we should have the file output pod.txt. Let's get the content. And as you can see, we have the text. Congratulations, you have passed the CK exam. So this is it for this question. 